Welcome or welcome back to Nicole's Notions. Now, as you all know, I've been going through the 501 must-see movies. And if you remember from October, we were going through the Alfred Hitchcock movies, but I couldn't find his eighth movie, which is called Rebecca. And I still haven't found it, but what I did find was that they've released a redone version of Rebecca, starring Lily James and Army Hammer, this year on Netflix. And I watched that. Now, for anyone who doesn't know who Lily James is, I first met her playing Rose in Downton Abbey, and she's also Cinderella in the live action remake of Cinderella. She's also in that movie Baby. She's actually in a lot of movies. I'm surprised you don't know who she is already, but she <laughs> she's gorgeous. She does an amazing job, and this movie is no exception. She plays the main character, and I'd like to tell you her name, but they never say her name. So Rebecca isn't her. Rebecca is Army Hammer's first wife who's died. So the premise of the movie is that Lily James's character meets this widower. They get married. She goes back to his estate, and his first wife's ghost or shadow is really haunting her. That's all I'm going to say about it. Because again, like any other Alfred Hitchcock movie, there are huge twists and I really don't want to spoil it for anybody. So again, this isn't the Alfred Hitchcock version. This is a remake that came out in 2020 that is on Netflix right now. And I am telling you, if you like mysteries and thrillers, this one will not disappoint. This makes me want to watch the Alfred Hitchcock one even more. There's there's so much going on in this movie. I can't, I don't know what to say without giving it away. Every time there was a plot that was happening and I was sure this is how it was gonna end or this is the way it was gonna go, it took a total like right turn and then it like takes another right turn. It's, it is really interesting to watch because you, you really, it really builds it really reveals something really cool at the end, and I highly recommend it. If you if you have Netflix and are able to watch it and are into into watching mysteries and thrillers, give Rebecca 2020 a watch. If you want to continue on going through the 501 Must See movies with me, please hit the subscribe button and the notification bell, and we will see you next week with another movie from the 501 Must See Movies.